In this video, I'm going to show you a printmaking technique. Printmaking is when you make imprints on a paper using different kinds of tools. And one way to do printmaking is by stamping. This week, I'm gonna show you how to stamp using cardboard pieces. So I have a cardboard piece and some tempera paint. I'm also gonna show you how to do cardboard printmaking using just markers and water in case you don't have any tempera paint. So if you have tempera paint, you're gonna take your cardboard piece and dip it into the paint so that the edge is covered. And let's review the three different kinds of lines. Lines that go sideways are called horizontal lines. So first, we're going to make a horizontal line by stamping the edge of the cardboard all across the paper. And that's going to be the ground. Vertical lines are lines that go up and down. So now we're going to add a few vertical lines. But don't go all the way to the top because we need to put the roof on there. Some can be closer, some can be shorter. That is up to the artist. So if you don't have any tempera paint, you can just take your cardboard piece, take regular marker, color the edge of your cardboard piece, dip it in some water, and then you can make your prints. It's gonna be a little bit lighter, but it'll still work. So right now I am adding the roots using diagonal lines. Diagonal lines are lines that are tilting. Now I'm going to add some details. Maybe there's a door. Maybe there's windows. Maybe there's some patterns in the roof. So the design is totally up to you. You do not have to do the same as mine. So here is step number one for our cardboard printmaking. I did a castle because it has nice horizontal, vertical, and diagonal straight lines. But if you want to try and do something else, that is okay as well. I would just pick something that has, again, straight lines instead of curvy things like animals. So you could do robots, you could do different kinds of buildings, but think of something that has straight lines. And next time we'll be painting the rest of this, but we have to let it dry first. 